There are two types of bridges you can use in your game in which you're holding your cue stick properly. One is called the closed bridge and one is called the open bridge. Today we want to go into a method of developing the proper open bridge. You'll notice that the hand is placed on the table with the fingers together. This is step one. Put the hand on the table, all the fingers are against each other. Then you slowly spread the fingers and you'll notice that the fingers here as they're spread open allow for a good solid base to the hand of the table. Put a little bit of pressure into the table. The third step is to bring the thumb up and form a bridge like that which is called the V. You'll notice the V right here where the cue stick goes. We call this the V bridge. We call it the tower bridge. You can see it looks like a tower. And we also call it the open bridge. When you use this type of bridge, the cue stick will sit right there and go nice and back and forth very easily. Notice how nice it flows back and forth. Now you want to also make sure that your thumb doesn't fall down like that. So pretend there's a little drop of super glue between that thumb and that index finger. Then just put your cue right there again, swing back and forth, and let the cue stick go right through the V. And if you do that, you'll have the proper V bridge, tower bridge, or open bridge, according to Dr. Q. You're looking for a great way to have fun, meet new people, and play some pool. Join an APA Pool League today. Visit us online at poolplayers.com.